That's all I got. <laughs> <laughs> Serious. It was like, I don't know, 40 some odd minutes before. And he's like, you need to make a new intro. That's all I got. <laughs> we'll have we'll have to play that again like uh once once a few people get in here <laughs> maybe in the middle of the stream uh er uh good to see you chris pyatt good to see you uh bear says letting my pc warm up anytime you want to come up uh you're welcome yeah got bubble bibble good to see you you take over hi camel carl Susie d al bundy yeah i'm really glad that you guys all came i'm sorry we didn't set it up like sooner and thank you peanut and what life for coming up oh thanks for having me <laughs> always a pleasure hey tracy hey tracy tracy tatum yeah <laughs> so i don't know what the weather's like in all of you all's neck of the woods but um <laughs> it, since 11 o'clock last night to current right now we got in the ballpark of 20 inches of snow and it's still snowing yeah so um we've been a little bit busy <laughs> yeah, hi Kim. Hey Kim, good to see you. Good to see you. Yeah, so it actually you've been busy because I did most of the stuff. The only thing I did was undid I did a trail to the pond and uncovered the pond. That was it for snow. Yeah. Yep. Yeah, lots of snow blowing. Luckily the neighbor's got a big tractor and all kinds of toys. He helps plow out the driveway. But uh, he's got oh, right. a tractor. He's got like three dump trucks or with plows like it's just ridiculous assault plow oh he's got everything he's got everything yeah. hey grace good to see you and we're live <clears throat> yes hi grace <laughs> it's currently 65 here <sighs> that sounds uh, that sounds really good about right now yeah i think we're supposed to be let's see monday's like 45 um and then we start going back up like 40s, 50s for the next like week or two. That's about it. So we were actually warmer before the snow. Yeah. Camo says his snow is melting away. Send send yours here. <laughs> I wish we could. Yeah. It's like the last part of winter, you think? Like it's the very last oh. day. We oh, always so. have like some kind of weird last hoorah in spring. Vester. Hi, Vester. Yeah, we always get some weird thing in spring. See, this year we didn't have much of a winter. We no, had one storm. I think we had like six or seven inches. Other than that, it was like a couple here, yeah. dusting there. Really was weird. Yeah, very mild. 40s, 50s, 60s. I mean, we had a nine-day stretch, I think, of like some chilly weather. But other than that, it was really mm -hmm. mild. Uh, Sharon Whitmore says Missouri is 46 right now. It's I wish we had 46 to melt this snow away. Good to see you, Sharon. Yeah. Well, we're going to get rain and warmer temperatures, so that should help melt it. And then we're going to be like mud season. Yeah, right. Yeah. You yeah, guys that's... have mud season where you live? <laughs> is, that a, is that a thing, Watt and Peanut? Where you guys live mud season? <laughs> no, I don't think there is such a thing as mud season. <laughs> really? You usually call it a hurricane season. Yeah, we got we got winter and then we got spring and then we have spring just kidding back to winter. We go mud season. Yeah. We have what mud is, seasons in between. What is mud season? It's where everything's mud. <laughs> it's when every the when the land is unthawing from the deep freeze and everything's just mush rivers and lakes are like flattened into roadsides and into people's yards and just past oh no we definitely don't have that uh, it's, and it's just mud like it's just mud everywhere yeah the the mountains up here when 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 the snow melt starts and, and oh, especially God. um well you got a lot of rivers up here but in particular you got the hudson which starts up um north of way north of us and as, it starts in canada and ends in new york city yeah we're not sure exactly where so i don't know where it starts hey bushcraft, Hi, bushcraft. Hey, bushcraft. it starts at Park Canada. okay yeah starts yeah. at the beginning how you doing bushcraft <laughs> oh not too bad i just yeah. noticed you guys were live <laughs> oh yeah i'm sorry we didn't set it up too late because it's been a crazy day and oh, I honestly man. didn't know how I was going to be feeling. So, hi, Kim. Yeah. Happy. It's like your birthday's next week, I think, right, Bushcraft? 
Uh, something like that. Something like that. <laughs> April oh, first. Yeah, April first. April first. Yeah. Well, not next Monday, but the one that Monday after that. Yeah, because uh, Easter is March thirty first. Yep. Yeah. So it's the day after. So tomorrow is Palm, Palm Sunday, right? Right. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Oh, I thought Easter was going to be on April Fool's Day. It was like <laughs> that would have been awesome. <laughs> guess what there aren't any eggs <laughs> yeah. 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 yeah or how about uh, the empty, April Fool yeah. like man this is the toughest Easter egg hunt ever yeah <laughs> right. eggs for everybody <laughs> yeah. oh goodness <laughs> so Bushcraft we were talking about mud season I know in Ohio we had mud season too that, that oh, yeah. time period between spring and summer where you, everything's unthawing and it's just mud. Especially if you're down by the Muskegon. Oh, yeah. Mm. <laughs> well, that river looks like it's mud. <laughs> oh, it is. <laughs> it's yeah. not like here, is it? Like everything's blue and green. And yeah, I know. I, I remember the first time oh, first time oh. I took uh, Lake to, to Ohio to visit. And uh, we I pulled up like there. Such a snob, we, 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 pulled like, up, we pulled up. We pulled up. We she got her first glimpse of the Muskingum River, and she's like, "What's wrong with the water?" <laughs> He's like, "We can go fishing in there if you want." And I'm like, "Oh, oh no." <laughs> there's big catfish in there. Uh, yeah, oh, there's some big ones in there. <laughs> Hey, it's Dave Mole. Good to see hey, you, Dave. Dave. Hey, TH2. TH2, how you doing? <laughs> Home of the three-eyed bass. So, <laughs> I guess it's just all the sand and the mud. It is. It's, it's know, the, yeah. the, the, uh, <laughs> the river bottom's mud. The river it's, bottom. not, it's, it's not rock. Yeah. yeah. Mm-hmm. Up here, it's mostly rock. Yeah. 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 Oh, okay. North yeah, east, or, or northwest, you, you can find some in Ohio. Very, very, very little of them, though, <laughs> that are not muddy. Susie D, that's what I figured out it is because it started moving around and then it even gave me a kind of like a, I'm not ill, like I'm not sick. I just, I had that like nauseous GI belly for a while. But yeah, unfortunately, that's what it is. Camo says, I'm next to the Flint River. I've never seen anything alive in it. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> hey, sassy cat. Good to see you. Hey, sassy cat. Yeah, I, I guess his would be worse than the Muskingum River. <laughs> That's where the, uh, the drinking water thing issue was, too, right? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Wow. Well, that was mainly because the pipes are, yeah, you know, lead pipes and. Yeah. Yeah. Nuts. So, um, I was out snow blowing today and, and got all finished up and I'm like soaked, you know, getting snowed on and I'm soaked. So I come in and I, I sell cha- your pants. Yeah. <laughs> I come in and I change. And then a little bit later we decided we got to go out and pick up some things. So I'm out there cleaning the truck off and I got my nice new, like light gray Carhartt hooded sweatshirt on. <laughs> She's like, Oh, that sweatshirt's really nice. It matches your beard. I was like, was that supposed to be a conversation? <laughs> well, I recording to get the rest of the conversation. <laughs> but his sneakers and his sweatshirt, it's like it was gray and white. And yeah, it's like I came from the movie Twilight. It must have been sparkling out there in the sun or something. Yeah, you looked, you looked kind of majestic up against the snow. <laughs> Very <laughs> majestic. Was, like, glistening off from the white sneakers and, sorry, kind of shoes. To me, they're sneakers. Yeah, uh, never sneakers. <laughs> Dave says, we have a lot of ice damage on the trees down my way. Loss of power for a few hours now. So, oh. yeah, Dave, we got hammered up here with almost around 20 inches. And it's still going. Yeah, it's still snowing. It's kind of spitting, though. I think Dave got uh, <laughs> a, little, a little further south. They got it, that mix that changed to the ice mixture. earlier. Oh, yeah. that was all the colors. I, I sent it to Nicolette. Mm-hmm. The, the middle yep. child and i was like look all the pretty colors <laughs> she goes those aren't pretty though. no that's ice yeah yeah hey Hi, kitty. kitty good to see you kitty how you doing <laughs> i'm not chatting okay so 
I wanted to try something different tonight. And I didn't know how this is going to work out. We never but, um, do. Yeah. Uh, I took, I, I devoted a whole lot of time to this. No, you it didn't. was like literally like three minutes. Um, <laughs> wow. Yes. That was a lot of time. <laughs> um, but I found a website that's got a lot of, um, so they're older, but they're, they're just optical illusions. Um, I thought we could take a look at each one and see what you guys think. Is like, like the ink letter test? Or like you yeah. see an author or something? Yeah. Me and my psychiatrist used to do this again. <laughs> <laughs> right? And Guess how just, insane you are. Yeah. <laughs> 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 Hi, Eric. Hey, Karen. Hey, Eric. Good to see you. We're oh, usually in tears by the end of the session. Right. It's a very sad but happy kind of game. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm picturing like um, uh, Brennan on Step Brothers going to his therapist. You know, was, it, was it that kind yeah. of thing? <laughs> That's before, funny. <laughs> before we start, though, does anyone else want to come up? Eric, do you want to come up? Hi, Miss Sue. Hey, Miss Sue. Sue. Good to see Grace, you. Susie. Good to see you. Anyone? And yeah, I'll, I'll put the link there in the chat if anybody wants to come up. Yeah, you're welcome. So we, can, we can always resort to chloroform. You know, this is true. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> they wake up and they're on the show. Is there an AA Ron? Is there an AA Ron in chat? <laughs> <laughs> Do we have a D nice? D nice. <laughs> uh, Denise? That's it. Anybody else seen that? He and Peels, or whatever that is, that, that substitute yeah. teacher. They're funny. I don't know where they come up with that stuff, but yeah, they're pretty funny. Yeah. We have a block, eh? <laughs> My name is Blake. <laughs> we you know, they just it. redid that skit. They made it, uh, I think it was a part two. Yep. Yep. We would play it, but it's got some squares in it. Oh yeah. It's, oh yeah. yeah. It's it's good stuff. It's funny though. <laughs> <laughs> Dave Mole says he's seen it, yeah. <laughs> it's hilarious. Yeah. And then how they, they do comedy, but the one guy he does like uh suspense type movies. Um, and it's weird how he's can be that diverse, can make good comedy stuff and good like suspense slash, uh, I guess you call it horror maybe. Oh. Yeah. Well, Eric, I hope Pops is, has a better night. Yeah. Yeah. It's good to see you. Good to see you, Eric. Always. Hey, OP. Operator. Operator. Good I know. To see I still you. like to call him OP. I, I like his, his attention to enunciation here. Sue Z. D. <laughs> I've heard something like, about this guy. It looks like suicide D. Yeah. You know, I heard something about this operator. I heard he's pretty smooth. Smooth <laughs> operator. Smooth operator. Okay. I heard he's a, I heard he's a prankster. Neighbor. Yeah. 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 Interesting. Yeah. In a rent. <laughs> something in the private chat for you, Peanut. Uh, oh, okay. Let's see. Uh, oh, by the way. Okay, oh, thanks. Please. Yeah, you know, Bush, I think I just saw it come through, too. Uh, mm -hmm. Thanks. I'm, I'm going to take a look at that uh, when I get a chance. All right, huh? Woohoo. Mm -hmm. Good to see you, Christy. Yeah. Thank you guys at last minute's notice for all coming in and coming up on panel and whatnot. Yeah. So I, I don't know how this is going to work. I'm going to try to share this. Um, it's just a website, and I'll have to scroll down. We'll look at each one. We're um, going to wing it. Right. So if you see ads for like um, <laughs> stay free, whatever, I'm, I apologize. Weird. I'm just saying, I, I don't know what's going to pop up here. For stay free. Yeah. This. Um, now that you said something, those ads will come up. <laughs> Probably. That yeah. conversation we had with Allie earlier that she commented on. Yeah. yeah uh huh. Okay. That's, that's really cool. I wondered I have, that one night he was. Uh, talking about something and as soon as he started talking about it pop the ad started popping up on youtube it did. <laughs> all right so i'm gonna try to share this these are just some optical illusions that we could take a look at and they're old ones yeah this is old stuff um if i can where are you Down there. oh i've seen this one before oh, there it is 
No. Yeah, it's 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 some older stuff. I see both. Um, so these are this is twenty classical or classic optical illusions that stump everyone. I thought this is pretty interesting. Is that the bottom of the picture? Uh yeah, yeah, it's pretty irrelevant. That's that's the part you need to be looking at right there. It looks like a woman with a hat with one of those hairy things. Yeah. So what do you guys what do you guys what's the first picture that do you see, I, I see the old the, woman? I see the woman. I see the young woman. She's like in at the, the opera or something. You see the young in the Yeah, you see the young do you see the young woman or the old woman? Oh, I see a young woman now. That's weird. I see both. I see both too. Yeah. Whoa, I can see both now. That's so cool. Yeah. If, if you can't see nose. it, there is um yeah, the old lady has the big nose and the, the long chin, and the younger yeah. woman is looking away from the camera and, and the her, old lady's eyes actually her ear. Right. And her mm -hmm. the young woman's chin line would be the woman, the old woman's nose. Yeah. That's so cool. Yeah. Hey Beach Harmon, CJ. CJ. Good to see you. Uh, Karen says she sees a young woman by a tree. Yeah, it kind of looks like tree bark, right? Mm -hmm. She's like staring yeah. right at that tree. Like she's like like an inch from the tree. Yep. So is there anybody in chat that does not see two women in this picture? I was just I'm just curious. This one actually took me a minute. I never saw the yeah. younger woman at first. Yeah, see, that's funny because some people saw the younger woman first, which means they have a distant eye, where others saw up close the older woman. Yeah. Hey PNW, good to see you. Hi, PNW. So everybody's got that one? Uh yeah. Sassy Cat says, I cannot see the woman one. Okay. Yeah. Can someone explain? Sorry. Maybe you can zoom up on it. I oh, you were in there. Is the links in chat? If you want us to do it again, we can do it again. Oh, I, see, that's weird though. Okay, so picture this right here. I think you can that's see my ear. cursor moving. The ear. That's that's the ear of the younger woman, and here's her eye. She, and here's her nose. She's so looking bad. away. And here's her jawline right there at the so bottom. Jaw. Here's her jawline right here. And that would be her necklace. The yeah, that's a, that's her it. necklace, correct. Yeah. And then the old lady, this is her eye. This will be her other eye. And the large nose, mouth, and yeah. chin. That's so and weird. That's an amazing picture. it would picture. be a mole. <laughs> <laughs> okay, sassy mole, Cassie. Mole, mole. All right, very good. Hey, um, Rosie. Sharon says, I do not see two. You don't? Um, Do you now, though? He explained it. Yeah, it might help. Grace says it helps to hold it away a bit. Oh, okay. What about the horse? There's a horse? I see the horse. You see a horse? Hmm. You try yeah, to throw I mean, us yeah. off with crap. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's a horse, of course. Okay. Very you good. Don't see the horse right, so that right there in the, his nose. No, I think you on the playing. top right. <laughs> what does she mean, like on the top oh, right? No. That, <laughs> well, it kind of looks like a horse. Like, no, I'm starting to see a horse. Like, no, you mean like definitely see uh, horse. rotated there. 33 degrees to the left? <laughs> so here we go. Well, I mean, if that could look like an octopus. <laughs> oh, oh, no, 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 no. Horse, uh, an octopus, like no. Octopus. Okay, hold on to your seat. I'm, <laughs> I'm going to be scrolling here. I have to scroll back. Pass some stuff to get to the next one. So hold on if you get busy. All right, I'm not watching. Do, 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 do. Just kidding. Do, 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 do. Okay, <laughs> this one is called The Impossible oh, yeah. Trident. First published in 1964 mm -hmm. by D.A. I like this one. Sh Schuster. This one's so hard. Yeah, it's just, it makes my mind go. Oh. I think a lot of people have the... seen this one. Yeah. Yeah, I can't make that any smaller, which makes it hard to see. But it looks like there's three. I don't know if you can look at the page. Looks like there's the three um, points coming down, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. And then if you the scroll up, it's impossible. The third one, oh, yeah, it connects to nothing. Exactly. Mm. Whoa. Mm. Mind blown. Kind of. 
Yeah. Good optical illusion. Oh, right there. Maybe it's clear at the top. It's clear at the top. What the heck? It's clear at the top? Yeah, it's clear at the top and solid white bottom. That's my story, and I'm sticking to it. It's clear at the top. Okay. Maybe they cut it off. Nice. That was optical illusion uh, number two. Yeah, and some of these are, um, yeah, CJ says that one gives me a headache. Yes. <laughs> me too. Yes. Yeah, this one is, uh, okay. This one is something else. Just, hold on, I'm going to scroll. This is, it's it's also known as the impossible fork, the devil's tuning fork, or a blivet, whatever that means. Blivet. It could be blivet. <laughs> blivet. 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 It's all French, a blivet. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> 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 it's a buffet. I put a little in the bathroom. A buffet. Hello. I Hi, like John. a good buffet. Good to see. Right. <laughs> hey, Jeff, Jeff, are you there? Yeah, I'm here. I'm here. When you look in the optical illusion too, if you look at the top, you see four legs, but when you look at the bottom, you only see in three. This one's freaking me out. This one's moving. Oh, yeah, does this look like it's moving to you? I think like I'm at like first it looked like getting a flashback. Off of this at one. first it looked like a hole. Yeah. Oh. You just stare dead at the middle and don't blink. If you move your the, eyes real slow. Do you see the the one no, blue move your eyes real down? slow from? Oh man! It's like melting. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Far out, bro. All right. Well, believe it or not, this is this is these these are not moving. These are not moving, and those are straight lines. But if you move your eyes back and forth, <laughs> up and down, corner to corner, you can see where it moves. Yeah, it this is not moving. Uh, this one was pretty cool. There's one coming up. It's because the shading is different on each dot, and there's light yeah. on each dot that makes it different. You have to look at each dot. One has a dark shade on one side and a light shade on the other side, and it keeps and it changes yeah. every dot, like a crescent. That's true. That's true. Um, yeah. and it, it looks like it these lines of dots. Reason. It looks like the lines are wavy, but I think those are straight lines. They are. Yeah, they are. It just it's, really it's messes just, with you. The only thing it's contrast and the shading is the shading. Yeah. <laughs> Uh -huh. The lighting and the shading. It's crazy how important something like that is in art to make that that big of an effect. <laughs> I won't. So, um, I actually can't with that one because it gets my vertigo. Like I actually am putting my hat down. If you look at this picture on the website, it looks like this thing is just waving like a flag. I don't know whether it's, like, it's just well, not coming through right on stream. Makes me want donuts. Uh, paint the whole house that way. All you have to do is focus on the blue and focus on the other colors. There's a guy like that, the uh, the doodle guy. Did you see this guy? He got like an all white house, and the inside and outside is completely covered in doodles. Hmm. It's oh, I can see that. Yeah, these are the most the same. Interesting. I think the doodle house is out in California. Two dots in the middle. Appear to be different sizes. <laughs> oh, yeah, I think this so the, the, is it the, 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 So we're looking at this dot and this yeah. dot. This one Perception. and this one. This one kind of yeah, gives you the right. illusion that it's bigger. Yeah, yeah. But they are the same size. Just, yeah, same size. Yep, yeah, I just measured them. The smaller dot. It's because you're comparing them. The smaller dot. <laughs> I, I use my envelope <laughs> with all my uh, messages on it uh -huh. to measure and make sure that it's the same size. <laughs> yeah, that's why you, you can mail that. Yeah. That's good. That's good. Keep using those envelopes. Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah, the two blue dots in the center, those are exactly the same size. Because the small dots around the larger circle makes the larger circle pop out more. So it makes it appear bigger yeah. than it actually is. Pretty cool uh, optical illusion. So my psycho are visually disturbed. Oh, B, you're fine. 
<laughs> okay, this one literally messes with me. Oh, God, no. Oh, okay. heck no. This uh -oh. illusion is known as the cafe wall illusion since it was first observed outside a cafe. Weird. This is insane. Now, I don't, I'm going to look on stream. Those lines going across are, those are not curved lines. Those are straight. They're straight. They're lines. straight. What that's the a, hell? That's again not the same. The more, the more you stare at it, though. Wow. Keep, keep staring at it. Don't blink. It moves. Yeah. It gets closer but, and closer and closer. Hey, Tina. <laughs> they are straight. Hey, Tina. But w once you focus on the shadows, it's just straight lines. Yeah. It's that's what yeah. throws her off. Do you guys in chat lines. see curved lines? I do. <laughs> Again. Yeah. Um, this looks catches like some trails uh, off this one. <laughs> <laughs> oh, well, I really got to lay out that CBD oil. <laughs> <laughs> you know they messing with messed up people. I'm gonna put it like that. Oh man, I didn't know I was muted. Sorry. Yeah, this one is moving for me too, CJ. I can't help me. Once you start this. kind of focusing towards the middle, it kind of starts changing. Oh, thank you. Yeah, this one like. Okay, well let, let me it. point something out to you on this. All right, I want see. See this square I'm, I'm circling right here? Which one? Yeah. Okay, there's it's the, the third row down on the left. You see the distance between these two, those two lines? It sure seems like mm -hmm. it gets wider when you get over here to the right, but it, it does not. That's just those are parallel lines. Uh, it's just the squares are off just enough to make it all whacked. It's the black yeah, squares. Call that, right? Looks like they're kind of. That they're like all diagonal in different directions. You know what I mean? Take like, me. <laughs> Take me out. I was waiting on uh, Peanut to call it trippy. Trippy. <laughs> yeah, I was thinking that too. <laughs> it's very trippy. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> this and that. Out, out of life. all of all of. Yeah, out of all of the illusions that we're going <laughs> to look at tonight, this is the one that messes with me the most. Which one? This yeah, one or the one too. next? Yeah, it's like a DUI test or something. Chris, what, yeah. what you should do <laughs> is follow one line on the left side and follow the same line all the way across to the right side. Yeah. Bending. Focus on it. Do the, do the bottom line. Yeah, it's all messed up. <laughs> no, it's straight. It's straight. Oh, to stay focused on one line. Oh, yeah. And you can go all the way up, right to left. All the way up. My eyes are closed yeah. and I can still see it. But it's still breathing. I know, right? You too. But they're all straight lines. It makes me feel like I'm on a bridge looking down. I don't know. Or it makes the bridge is about to collapse. collapse. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> like an Indiana Something. Jones bridge. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> the rope's all being frayed. Grace says, play the Twilight Zone theme song. Yeah. Or like oh. Alice got oh. lost in Wonderland somewhere. Hey, Patriot. Like good to see you. Someone was like stacking up cups of coffee on this cardboard, and it's all heavy coffee, and it started to bend and stuff. If I stay in the room like that for more than five minutes, I'll be on the ground. I like the old Donkey Kong yeah, game, remember? You and me both. Oh, yeah. yeah, yeah, like Donkey Kong, huh? These oh, things. Yeah. There used to be a, a place in These California to where you'd walk in, and the, the rooms were wonky looking just Mystery to throw spot? you off. The, yep. the the floors were crooked and they didn't look crooked when you went in. Hmm. Forget I about like, that. Uh, it might be like you talking about like um, Winchester House or the mystery spot, maybe. I could I can't remember. I I just remember it was in California, I think on Route 101. Oh, you might be talking about um uh like up near where I'm at, they got um they have something that's called what's it called? Um it's like the mystery spot. I forget what to get the name is. Where, where like it looks like a ball's going rolling uphill. And stuff yeah, like that. yeah, I know exactly. It's a like, bunch of things that mess with your mind. Yeah, something hill or something. I mean, I'll find it. 
that what CJ is that what CJ's talking about there? The mystery spot in Wisconsin Dells. There's more than one of them. Yeah, there's probably oh, one. Yeah, of there's them. there's probably a lot of them. Yeah, where it looks like okay, stuff's rolling up here. And you actually walk Get through these, these rooms you know, and even. things. Uh, Confusion Hill. That's the one near me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We have mysteries. Okay. We'll scroll on to the next. See what we can yeah, find Yeah, get here. that thing off. Oregon Making Vortex. Sure. And again, <laughs> there's probably a lot of them. Maybe crib lasagna. Okay. Uh, this one's pretty cool. I see. Yeah. When you when you look at this grid, um, do you see the circles? Like, yeah. No. no, I don't see at the intersections. You got to look at this the, again with the shadowing. Yeah. I, 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 I'm no good at this because I can always see them. All I see is an oversized tic-tac-toe board. Are they like gray and then they disappear for a second? The circles? Yes. <laughs> Makes me think of Jeopardy. Yeah. Mm -hmm. At every intersection. Yeah. Looks like waffles. <laughs> At every intersection of the white lines, you should see you should see a a, a gray dot that some kind of fades in and out. Yeah, I can see some that. Some people don't see it. Okay. And you try to focus on one, and it kind of the one you focus on tends to go light lighter colored. Right. Yeah. Like, like whackable. Yeah. When you go. Yes. So some people can't see this one. Well, if you're focusing on one square, you probably won't. But if you look around, they definitely show up. Yeah, they really jump out. Uh, That's so, be well, big. focus on uh, the black later. square and you'll see you'll see the gray. Yeah, there you go. Dave sees it. As soon as she sees smaller boxes within the box. Yeah. yeah, kind of. Yeah. Yeah, they show up late. Yeah, I see illusion. a Rubik's cube hmm. inside of black, white bamboo shoots. <laughs> That's a Rubik's cube. You, you couldn't thing. get. You could always show <clears throat> an all black one. <laughs> yeah. Are the outside rectangles I can the do same that size one. or different? You know, there's like those like thinner ones on the outside and the right and the left are those. Uh, I'd say the ones on the right are probably smaller. smaller. If you look at the bottom. Hey, Beth, row, Rob, good to see you. Crosses that prep says, I also see crosses in the black boxes. That's interesting. I, I can kind of see that too. That's cool. That, that it's, makes, it's that an means act, you need to put your, 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 your glasses on. <laughs> all right very good let's move on to the next one you know we're all going to have to make a trip to the eye doctor after this right really yeah. <laughs> okay here we go that illusion dates back to the 1870s the dots are the result of a neural process called inhibition the capacity of an excited neuron to reduce activity Okay, we're not going to read that. Why? The neurons yeah. process all of it, so black dots appear. That's interesting. Okay, this one messes with. Me. Okay, this elephant is at the center of a of a L. What le, leg? Central quadrant. Yeah. How many legs does this elephant have? <laughs> it only has. I see a. Yeah, that looks weird. It's like the other 16. one. Six. Look, look at the look at the other one. It's the space in between one leg and the trunk. And oh, he's got four legs. legs. Yeah. But it looks but it looks like four. Just look at the you toes. Guys in two. I cover up the toes and look at the legs. You can see there's four legs. Yeah, the That's easy like way to do Yeah, if 
if you take your finger and you if you take your finger and you you block out all of the feet, you can see the four legs perfectly. Wow. Yeah. Take your finger and cover up the yeah. four feet. Now you can see the four legs perfect. Right. But it looks like there's one, two, three, four, five. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it is. Just a Dumbo you effect. Take your finger and block out the feet. <laughs> That's cool. You guys all see that? Four? Yeah. Oh, yeah. It looks like potentially five. He's got five legs. Yeah, it's that <laughs> it's that space between uh, the trunk and his first front, his right front leg. It looks like there's an extra foot in there. Okay, so he's crazy. Yeah, and there's only poor there's elephant. Only, he got five oh. legs, and there's only one foot on a, on the back leg. The other foots are all on, on the negative space. One, two, yeah. three. Only one leg has a foot on it, or like both. <laughs> one leg has a foot yeah. on it. It's weird. The whole thing is messed up. <laughs> it's really messed up. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I think I'm seeing one. I don't know how many legs I'm the seeing space anymore. Between, I the space between the two back ones is not right. a leg. Just look okay. at the body. Yeah, it's not a leg. More, more like yeah, just follow the body down. Stop looking at the toes. It's really messed up. <laughs> <laughs> was a joke there. Christy says I was given a stuffed eight? rabbit. Six legs. I see eight legs, just saying. <laughs> that prep says it looks like he's <laughs> kind of leg. See, Dave, six legs. Dave sees eight. I see eight. Yeah, sassy cat sees eight. Karen uh, sees eight also. Yep. That's what I see. Stu says it's his wife directly behind him on your side. Oh, <laughs> see, Sue thinks outside the box. There you go. All right, very. The good. other ones, uh, the other feet are stuck in the mud. It's mud season there. Think like an elephant. <laughs> okay, it says an easy way to solve this problem is to cover the feet. Then you'll be able to clearly see the elephant only has four legs. The reason it looks so trippy is that the artist left the natural space for the feet blank. Instead, drawing the feet in the spaces between the legs, this confuses your brain and makes you see the spaces as legs as well. So you you yeah. were right, Pina. The the feet are not drawn on the legs; they're drawn in the negative space. Yeah. Yeah. Except for the one of them, the the, ba the very the very first foot is attached to the a leg. Back one. Yeah. yeah back yeah. one. Back one close. Yeah, to the us. very back one. Cover up the. Bottom. Yeah. No, it looks scroll like it down. Okay. Yeah, yeah, I can do that. You guys see that now? Now does it make sense? Yeah. Now that it's scrolled down, now now you can see the four legs clearly. <laughs> but do you see the old I'll one scroll, I'll scroll, <laughs> I'll scroll back up again. And you can see that the feet are drawn in, in the wrong spot. See, there's the four legs. And the feet are drawn in the negative space. That's a pretty yeah. cool drawing. Yeah. Yeah, it's pretty neat. Imagine if we had wild elephants here. Oh, we probably did a long time ago, though. Like mastodons, huh? Could be. Yeah, well, I would like, love to see a mastodon if they ever came back. Instead of bringing the woolly mammoth back, so. Yeah, that'd be cool. I'd love that. Jurassic Park Live 2028. Pretty cool. Or a saber-toothed tiger. Hey, Rip. Don't give him an idea. Right. <laughs> All right, let's move on to our next one here. I'm eating all these Cadbury eggs, so if you want some, I'll have to get more out. Okay, it says the circle appears to be colored light blue, but it's actually the same shade of white. So it's, it's talking what? about this space in between these blue, blue lines. You see the white oh, space between the blue lines. Oh, I get the, it. Like this triangle. Yeah, I see it. Yeah, weird. Either way. This looks like yeah. the shade of blue. Right. But it, yeah, it's actually white, the same as this out here. Oh, I see. That's a That's trip. weird. Just the way you look, your mind yeah. processes lines. Yeah. It, it, I mean, it does kind of look like that. The white coloring in the center is, is a 
got a bluish hue to it. Yeah. That knows me so well. Uh, Oops. Cut down the wrong way. Oh, great. They let King Kong out what? again. Goodness. I'm not sure what ideas, but I have lots of them. Oh, pass is like an orb. Wow. Yeah. Very cool. Dave says he thinks it looks blue too. Yeah. Mm-hmm. It's interesting. Okay. And this says this type of illusion first appeared in 1971 <laughs> when psychologist Dario Varin published one in the book, Chromatic Contrast in Diffusion Phenomena. The reason your eye so perceives the circle to be the same color as the lines is relatively unknown. It's just the way our brain works. And, and look, we, we yep. did end up dealing with psychologists after all. Exactly. <laughs> see. Oh, this this one never right showed here. up for me. I couldn't see that earlier. Oh, I thought that was the illusion. There was no illusion. Okay, this illusion is called the. Yeah, right. right. This illusion is called the Kaniza Triangle. Yep. You see a white triangle. If you look at this, what does your brain process? Right. You see, you see a couple triangles here, right? Okay. No. I'm going to give you the 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 answer to this. Calling this illusion first seen in 19. 55 a triangle is actually a bit of a misnomer there are actually there are no actual triangles no triangle. anywhere in the it's illustration a it's a star there's negative space and and you have angles there are no there are oh, no it's like triangles. the other one the yeah, yeah, triangles are not finished you have an angle and a pac-man an angle and a pac-man an angle and a pac-man the rest of it's just negative space oh the pac-mans make yeah, your your like your brain connects that negative space into a triangle. Interesting, anyway. Yeah, I saw a star at first. Yeah, like a Jewish star. Oh, yeah. yeah. Right. I see three Pac Man. Yeah, I see that. I see both. Looks like it. Um, yeah. All right. Uh, says your brain fills in the gaps in the line segments in the black circles and assumes there should be a triangle there, also known as the phantom edge phenomenon. Phenomenon. Oh okay. boy, here we go. Our next <laughs> one. <laughs> These three lines appear to all be different lengths, but are actually the same size. We did this one in school. This one's hard too. Yeah. The They're all the same size. A yeah. line, a segment, a fragment. Leave the lines yeah. in the of it. Stop, yeah, stop focusing on the the triangles or the half triangles. Mm-hmm. The quarter angles. Mm-hmm. Yeah. That was pretty interesting. A popular explanation for this illusion is uh, is the carpentered world. People eyes become accustomed to corners so when we see angles like the arrowheads our eyes perceive them as corners and completely overpowers the retinas which yeah Yeah. oh this one messes with me bad rotating snakes is another example of illusory (laughs) motion (laughs) rotating snakes this the name is hilarious <laughs> now yeah, that is that moving? No. Oh, wow, wow, this, whoa, 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 whoa. Does, it, does this look like it's moving to you? I am definitely yeah, tripping on this one. This yeah. one makes me want donuts. <laughs> 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 right, exactly. Stop I'm on 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 exactly. And just focus on the black dot in the middle. It's mm-hmm. melting. As soon as you focus on the black dot in the middle, it it, it stops moving. Yeah, I'm with CJ. It moves. It moves. For me, I see motion here. Let me try to zoom in on this a little bit and see if it makes it better or worse. (laughs) It's like an interdimensional motion. 
They're still <laughs> moving. They are definitely moving. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Have you ever seen the, the, the images? It's like whenever you zoom in, no matter how far you zoom in, it's something else. You just keep zooming in into infinity. Pretty much. I'm like my soul's being swallowed up by that thing. Now, yeah. if you look at these two circles, if you look at the one on the left, the one on the right looks like it's spinning. Yeah. And vice versa. They're both moving. It's an interdimensional portal. It's your focus. It's like the. Uh, it's like the golden rule. <laughs> Pretty cool stuff. Very, very cool. <coughs> now into the twilight right, so zone. Some of you guys can see it moving when... when I think I'm being in. programmed now, with MK Ultra. Yeah, you know, there's... There's a... Um, a lot of these... A lot of these illusions, they require... 3D perception, and if you don't have really good uh, 3D 3D vision, um, where where your your brain takes the two visions from from your two separate eyes and makes one image, and you can see depth with that. Um, if like I don't see very good out of my right eye, and I I have trouble with um, with depth perception like that. So a lot of these I have trouble seeing seeing the movement, but I can see this one. Like when my face gets really close to yours and I freak you out. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay. <laughs> so that that was called rotating snakes was invented by Akiyoshi Kitako in two thousand three. This specific type of illusory motion is called peripheral drift. While the one part that you focus on doesn't appear to move, all of the snakes in your peripheral, peripheral vision appear to spin. And that's exactly what I see. That's so cool. Yeah, very cool. Peripheral drift. That sounds like a um, like a um, movie or something. That is. Oh. Yeah, it does. <laughs> the bunny rabbit in the duck. Uh, so here we you go. See, just, yeah. just, yeah, do you see the rabbit? I see both. Rabbit or both. I didn't know what I was. Rabbits I saw looking the right, first. the ducks looking left. I think it's the Easter Bunny. Yeah. yeah. Right. Which did you see first? The Easter uh, I Bunny. Think I, I don't remember. I saw. <laughs> yeah. I think I saw the bunny first. I see both of them though. And once it tells you duck and rabbit, it out, your mind automatically goes to those images of you know everything you've seen of a duck and everything you've seen of a duck. rabbit. When you said duck and rabbit, <laughs> but if you kind of squint, it looks like a seagull. Like... Yeah, a little it bit. Does. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. You're right. It's actually more like a seagull than a duck, huh? Hmm. Bee Look at the bees and all that. It's one of them North Carolina ducks. Yeah, it looks like saw the, the, the duck first. These two saw the goose first. I saw them both, but like I saw the duck and then I saw the rabbit. Like it was like boom, boom, boom. boom. You know what I mean? Yeah. Mm. Let's see. Sharon says, I see a duck. Equine freedom. Good to see you. Equine. Seagull. Uh, Karen <laughs> says, duck was. First, then the Easter Bunny, and Sue says duck and bunny. <laughs> duck, duck, bunny. Uh, Susie D says, "Yep, a seal too." Do we have a seal here? A seal. seal. Yeah, Could be. See a seal oh yeah, it looks like a seal. There. If you look at the the, if you look at the um the ears or whatever it is. Yeah. Definitely looks like a seal. <laughs> Pat Evans says, yep. "Mine, mine, 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 mine." Find a new. Uh, yeah, there's a funny deal. He says, I looked in the eye and saw both. Yeah. All right. Very good. Very good. Okay. <laughs> He's like, um, no. <laughs> I love it. Okay. This says, while the original wow. drawing was published anonymously, Joseph Jastro first made note of it in 1900. This duck wow. rabbit hybrid is considered an ambiguous image. If you're having trouble seeing the rabbit, turn your head to the left. The duck's beak can also be the rabbit's ears. I still think yep. it's a oh, duck. Oh, that's weird. That's the last one I'm right now. I'm that's yeah. weird. Mm -hmm. Yeah, if you guys turn your head back and forth, left to right, you can almost see it easier. Yeah. It's a Polynesian duck. 
Like, what do we got next? Oh, oh there we go. Now, this That's one I couldn't I see. Magic Eye Pink. What? They yeah. were all the rage in the 90s. We used to, Was it? We used to see the Well, let me scroll up. It says, uh, Magic Eye came to America in 1993 in a book called Magic Eye, A New Way of Looking at the World. Magic Eye illusions are officially known as stereograms or 3D illusions. Technically, they're 3D illustrations hidden within 2D graphics. Mm -hmm. Not everyone can find the hidden picture in Magic Eye graphic. And if you can't, it could mean you're having problems with your eyesight. If you're really stumped, try getting really close to the illusion and focus on one point slowly move backwards from the screen and keep focusing on the one point yeah so you're supposed to be able to see this shark earlier. in the top picture also you look at the picture but you don't look at the picture does that make any sense probably not yeah you gotta make it bigger down it kind of helps because it gives you a point of no, reference you just want to yeah, you have to see the shark, right? Or do you, am I supposed to show the shark? No, you don't show the shark. You just bring it down to that, to the colors. And now people are supposed to see go. a shark. Yeah, uh, do you see a shark in that? You guys see a Not shark yet. there? Uh -huh. mm -hmm. You you don't want your see, eyes to focus focus on the picture, almost yeah. like unfocused. Just think of uh, the fins. Mm -hmm. Man, so I want to trippy. scroll down. This is what you're supposed. This is what you're supposed to. Well, if it'll actually let me. <laughs> yeah, I remember those books as a kid. That's what you're supposed yeah. to. I don't believe it. Long enough, though, they're not going to be able to see it. I can't move the screen. You can see it, what? Yeah, I can't see it. How do you do it? Like, well, you, you got to focus, find you a spot mainly towards the middle and just focus on it. Okay. Um, and then it would help if you had it and then you look at it close and then like slowly okay. bring it away from you. Um, that could help as well. There, yeah, close your eyes and open them real fast. Our screen is locked up. Yeah, I can't do anything with yeah. my screen. I can't see it. Or if you're a fast blinker, yeah. Okay, so maybe if we have them both up there at the same time. But don't look at the bottom. <laughs> I, I don't know. I don't know how it's supposed to work. Somehow you're supposed to see that image of that shark in the top picture. Yeah, I did those as a kid. They had those for sale at oh. like places. Yeah, and we would all go around. So what's that stuff called? Uh, magic eye. I, what... I don't know. That one says, "Can you see the shark in the top picture?" In the top picture above. I never could see it. You get close to it and we move back. But don't focus, focus. Just kind of. I'm not seeing that one. Okay, what else we got? Yeah, they had several different series of books like that for kids in the 90s. Yeah, The Glass yep. and the Nurse to Two Men. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, depending on your focus, you can either see a vase or two faces staring at each other. I saw two faces. You Please guys in chat, what was the first? Thing? Yeah. Did you guys see the faces first or the va the vase? And they say, whoever sees which one. If you see the the two men, that's the dark side. If you see the light, that's the vase. Challenge. Are you focusing on the dark first, or are you focusing on the light first? Yeah, that's tricky. interesting. That, that's uh, the concept. black and white yes, thing. Is. I just kind of yeah. look towards the center and work my way out. Interesting. I can definitely see the vase, the vase though. Yeah, like a milk yeah, glass. Yeah, I see that too. 
Uh, so this yeah, is a um, variation on the. Go ahead, Matt. Oh, I was gonna say, just it looks like a chalice or something, or a Stanley Cup or something. Like, yeah, like a real yeah. Sort of fancy. Yeah. What I meant by milk glass is it's a kind of glass. It's really, really white. Oh, here okay. we go. If you <laughs> stare at this photo for at least twenty seconds and then immediately look at a blank surface, you'll see a familiar face. I had asked. Look at the ceiling. So stare at that. The focus. On the dots. Yeah, on the dots. All the four little tiny dots in the center. So focus on those for 20 seconds and then look at a blank space mm -hmm. and blink and see what you, what do you see? Oh, Jesus. Does right? it work for you? Yeah. Um, oh, wow. You look at the ceiling, though. Wow. No. <laughs> you I just looked at the desk. Yeah. That is amazing. I got to do that again. <laughs> That's trippy. It is trippy. I don't know if you guys can yeah. see that. <laughs> it's almost that as way, if you can see it in color reaction. in a way. Yeah, it's a lot more detail. Yeah. Um, when it's like when you look at the it'll turn away, the, the, what, the, what the eye retains out of it or whatever. Wow. That's amazing. That's, yeah, that's pretty cool. It's almost like looking at a, a negative of a photo. Yeah, that's a good point. I tell you what, yeah. just do, do this. Stare at that for stare at that for twenty seconds, and just close your eyes. Oh yeah, you can see it. Yeah, you don't even have to just close your eyes. That is so cool. You can see them oh, really, yeah. really tiny. You cannot. You have to focus and close your eyes a long time. Wow. But it's almost like you can see Jesus in your own eye. So amazing. It's like it. Uh, yeah, it's really cool. Very cool. Oh man, hey. yes, yes. <laughs> Let's see when you uh, okay. more detailed with your eyes closed. Yes. <laughs> These four dots. At least four little dots. Here in the middle. And then look at if you have a, a plain white ceiling, just look at your ceiling after that. And, look at and your, blank. And blank a couple times and then stop blinking. Oh wow. That is really cool. Look over there. Man, I can still oh, see wow. it still. Not amazing. Oh yeah, it's that's <laughs> That's something else. Yes. Yeah, <laughs> Dave Mole says, "Oh boy, I'm in trouble." <laughs> <laughs> yeah, if, 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 you guys, if you don't see Jesus, you gotta go read the Bible. <laughs> <laughs> <I'm in trouble. laughs> yes. All right, let's move on to our next one. Now you see why Allie had that reaction. Yeah, that's pretty cool. <laughs> I wonder if it would change uh, if you would flip the, the colors around. I wonder if that would have any effect. If you did. Uh, if you what's white around. would be black and what's black would be white. Oh, if the white and the black? Yeah. I don't, I don't, I don't know, know if that would have any effect. Probably not. Know. Maybe. Yeah. Interesting experiment. It says most people see Jesus. This illusion is called an after image. After you stare at it for a certain period of time, you'll see an image of Jesus. According to Encyclopedia Britannica, an after image is an illusion where retinal impressions persist after the removal of, of a stimulus believed to be caused by the by continued activation of the visual system. Basically, your eyes are still seeing something that's not there. Another common example are the dots you see after a camera's flash goes off. Right. Remember when the doctor told me that after my ocular migraine, I had, um, I would see like a plant outside and then I would see that plant in my vision, almost like translucent, um, translucent. It would be in my vision everywhere I looked for like a long time. That's weird. It is. This composite of Marilyn Monroe and Albert Einstein is known as a hybrid image. Oh yeah. <laughs> oh, man. That's creepy. I know. I'm not sure I, how I feel about this one. Mm -hmm. 
I'm still trying to figure out why why is a I don't think I like that carrying a Christmas tree. <laughs> yeah, right over to the right. <laughs> 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 Must be important. <laughs> oh goodness! Is yeah. Dixie watching these with us? Oh, MC okay, this one's called Waterfall. It yeah. water MC Esker. The waterfall's top and bottom appear to be at the same level. So you have right here the top of the waterfall. And the bottom of the waterfall. And if you follow this path, it goes right back. It looks where it like they're it. at the same level. Oh, uh, yeah. Yeah. Yep. That's, that's a pretty cool drawing. Weird. See this? Yeah, the waterfall. Yeah, picture the water. Mm -hmm. Picture it flowing backwards. Why would you do that? Okay, then don't. <laughs> so it's going to go backwards? Okay, picture it starting right here. Flat. Flat, 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 waterfall. That's right back down to where you started. Oh. It's all one level. There you go. It's like the water. It's like the waterfall falls, but it's it's starting and originating on this same level. Well, it's like two levels in one kind of because like three stories. Because the pit. What do you say, like? I, don't, I thought like it the, was like a couple of stories up. I think it's both because like it's the both, pillars are going pillars up, are throw you off. but the but the the walkway is the same level, so it's kind of like two at the same time. Hey Ralph, good to see you. Hi Ralph. Hi Jeannie. Hey Jeannie. Yeah, this high harvest merry moon. This one's weird. Yeah, but you I mean you can see it though, right? The, the picture of this water flowing through here, then over. And over and over. That's all flat. But to me, it was like yeah. upstairs. Right, because the waterfall gives you that depth, which is, that's what creates the illusion. Stop. Just don't look at the pillars. Right. It's the well, pillars that, that not. make you think that it's different le yeah, levels. That's weird. Yeah, the, the pillars. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. So it cool. feels like. But what are the pillars, pillars doing? I don't. I think it's both. Look at the house. The house. Confused too. Right, hey. <laughs> what? Are you confused too? Because like the all right. So you, you take the waterfall. The top right. of the waterfall is over top of the roof. Hey, Libra Cusp twenty three. Hi, Libra. It looks. <laughs> the waterfall is over the roof. That that would be your top level, and then yeah. as it goes toward, you know, it goes back and then it comes forward again. That would be around roof, roof level. The next one would be around roof level, and the next one would be around halfway of the house down. That's the way it uh -huh. looks to me, but that's that's weird. Yeah, it's, it's, I, think it's both, I think it's both. They're, like they're combining perspective at the same time. Uh, yeah, uh, uh, yeah, it's a little bit of both. Hmm. Yeah, everybody focuses yeah, on the stuff cool. on the outside. But the, the perpetuality, the perpetually flowing waterfall is based on another classic optical illusion called an impossible triangle or the Penrose triangle. Uh, what makes this impossible? The water falls from the top and is caught at the bottom it then appears to flow from the bottom clearly at a lower level back to the top but suddenly appears to be at the same height as the bottom <laughs> so yeah you're right they combined things oh so yeah, say, like this, this cube one. plays with human perception yeah. it's a bunch of uh, it's a side of a cube. just focus on the shading um, i don't that that's not what am I seeing here? Well, the cube can move. You can have the face wall towards like where you are. I've had the it 
almost like up on a wall where it looks like an air conditioning or a vent venting thing coming out of the wall. It's strange. See the top? It moves. Like the, the top of the cube comes over. And then you have this, which would appear to be the back leg. No, but it's in front of the top. The cube moves. The cube yeah. moves. So the cube. Uh, you know, I think moves. it is. Is that like uh, that our brains are trying to interpret this in terms of 3D or three dimensional, but it's really just a flat surface yeah. 2D. And so they're, they're playing with the, the, the two things. Yeah. Just pay attention to the, to the shading. Just, just forget the, it being just a cube. Just, just think of it as being lines, <laughs> lines and shapes and colors. So you guys see something that could be legitimately built here. I see a cup. Hi, cons or can squat. Thanks. Hans, good to see you. Yes, relax your eyes and see. Exactly. So, like, at first I saw the cube. The face of the cube was pointed towards you. Then the second cube I saw was almost, like, up on the ceiling, coming outward, almost like an air conditioning would look like from the outside of someone's home. Like a ventilation tube. Like this, cube. Yeah, this one's messing with me. It's it's like it takes on different cube illusions. So the faces of the cube moves. Depending what what color you focus on. Right. Yes, exactly. <laughs> so if focus you focus on the, on yellow. the yellow. Yeah. Focus on the yellow. B says, I see a perfectly built cube with a trippy paint job. <laughs> 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 uh Khan says uh, uh like uh, the Esker drawings. Yeah, that's what this one is. Yeah. Dana says an empty cube. <laughs> yeah, that one messes with my perception. Yeah. CJ says it. Just think of it as a cake. I love it. <laughs> a cake. Right. So what's I have to say about this? Yeah. Another illusion created by MC. Oh, you're right. First appeared in one of his lithographs called Bel Belvedere. Mr. Belvedere. Hmm. Example. Yeah, well, what makes the you side really freak out? There's a rabbit. The cube appeared to be. The other thing. <laughs> okay, moving on. We may we may be getting this one's pretty cool. This is trocular oh, yeah. fading circle. If you stare, if you stare at the dot for at least 20 seconds, the circle will completely fade away. Oh, true. So stare at that red dot for 20 seconds, and that, that blue circle will fade away. Oh, I saw it for a second. Wow. Oh, yeah. it does. Dang, it's, it's a trick. I think we're back. It works. <laughs> We stared at it, and, and then Lake and Bigfoot disappeared. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, you made right. us disappear. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Katina Birdcage. Hey, Katina. So does the uh, the blue circle disappear? No. I saw it disappear. No, it doesn't. It does for me. Yeah. If you stare really close, really focus on that red dot. Like everything you have, focus on. You, yeah. you, for us, you have to scroll back a little bit because you have the circle being. We can't see the full circle. I think that's what's throwing that it red out. dot, and the blue circle starts to fade away. Yeah, our, our internet's wonky right now. Probably the storm. Mm, could be. 
Uh, let's see. So, cons, you're supposed to look at that red dot. Focus on the red dot. I mean, closely look at the red dot, and that blue that blue circle around the outside makes the, makes it makes the blue circle kind of fade away. It gets really light colored. Yeah, I don't know if you heard me before, but um, you need to scroll back a little bit because you got part of the circle already blocked out, so it's throwing off the illusion. Right. Part of the circle. You have to make it small. Because you guys can see it because you got it in front of you. I can still see it, Bush, but it, it's hard. I, I couldn't see it, you actually. Gotta longer. But you're right. It probably make it easier if, if you had that. So you can't see like, that whole circle? I can now. Can you guys see the whole blue circle now? Yeah, that's working now. It's working yeah. now. Okay, that makes sense. It worked for me. Because you have to have a full circle there yeah. for, for it to, to disappear. Okay, it worked. Yeah, it worked for me the other way. But let's see. You guys in chat? You guys uh, seeing the blue circle? Yep. I, you know, I know, it's, I know that's on a small screen. It's hard, but I still see it. Yeah, like Jeff said, he's see, seen it disappear on his TV, but not on his laptop. Okay. It's yeah, it could be so small. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Go oh, like that, maybe. Would that work? Yeah. Yeah. And I'm still having a tr trouble with that dang Blackhawk over there with the tree. <laughs> I'm trying to focus on the red dot, but I still see that Blackhawk over there. <laughs> it's, it's all part of the illusion. It's distraction. <laughs> exactly. And that, that was the last. That was the last one. Man. Yeah, those are cool. Uh, where'd Jeff go? I don't know. He was muted, and then he just went away. Oh. Uh, Thanks, PMW, what, what? The, before you end, put up the pic I emailed, emailed you guys and tell me why I can't look at it, please. Is it just me? hurts my eyes and disturbs my brain. Okay, give me a second. I'll see if All I right. can find it. Still got it. Yeah, just yeah. talk yeah. amongst yourselves. Talk amongst yourselves. Brain feels like and it just did a hundred push-ups. Something in front of you. Hundred push-ups. <laughs> hundred push-ups. Uh, she might have sent it to your email. Oh, to my. I uh, what? Whose email did you send it to? Because I'm not on my laptop. Oh goodness. Let me go look. What were you talking about push-ups for, Bigfoot? What's no, that? I was, um, that was why. You gonna do, do hundred push-ups? I can send it to you. I don't, I don't think my my shoulders could handle a push. <laughs> wow, that's the thing with me, my shoulders. I'm gonna send it to yeah. Dick Deeper. Sorry, I was charging my phone in the other room. PNW. We got it. I just sent it to his email. I'm not on my laptop. We're on his. Yeah, just take me a second. <laughs> yeah, my my youngest son, he used to, when he was in school, he used to do push-ups all the time. That was kind of uh, like a therapy for him. Um, and the recruits would come to um, yes. the school and try to recruit people, you know, how they do. And if you do so many push-ups, you would get T-shirts and you know different things. And he would he would clean up because <laughs> he he gets he he does he could do more push-ups than anybody in the school. It's still showing her. I don't know if I'm going to be able to do that right. Uh, let me try this. No. You can 
can save the picture. We're just going to download the picture so that way we're not giving off your information. So let me try this. <clears throat> oh, yeah, I've seen this one. What? That, that's cool. The Doodle House, yeah. Yeah. Could you imagine having to live in there full time? Oh, <laughs> I couldn't do it. <laughs> I mean, I imagine to a, the artist, I imagine, you know, he loves it because it's all his creation, but yeah. I don't know. Yeah, he, he would be focused on each piece instead of like the whole thing. Get out of the email. That's fine. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to share that. Uh, I'm gonna try. Let me, let me see if I can find it here. A video file? Mm. Slides? Maybe. No slides. No. Try and PNW. We saved it to the computer, but I'm not sure if we can show it. Oh, cool. I don't know how to do that. I don't either. Yeah, I don't think I'm going to be able to do that. It is really trippy. I, yeah, that's hard to even look at that picture. Is that like a legit picture that he took? It's like full what of that? mirrors. That's, it's like a big skyscraper with with glass and mirrors reflecting. There's people everybody everywhere. It's, uh, <laughs> yes, it bugs. It bugs. The, <laughs> does it bug you guys? Yes. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Sorry, we can't show it without. She says, I love your hair tonight. Oh, thank you. Yeah, it was a piggy tail type kind of day. Kind of day. <laughs> yeah. Equine says, Did you dye your hair? Uh uh. It just looks darker for some reason on the laptop. <clears throat> it looks very red on the laptop tonight, and it's not. It's the hat. It's an illusion. Yeah, <laughs> it's a pig. It's the red pigtail illusion. They do though. They look super red, don't they? Look at the computer. It looks like like my cousin Liz. Yeah, it looks auburn. Yeah, that's definitely not. But it, I agree. It does look auburn in the. It does yeah. look red. Yeah. When I'm when I have my camera on, it it shows that I have a gray beard. I don't really have a gray beard. <laughs> 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 Well, when I show up at your stream, it says Lake Fairy has a beard. <laughs> <laughs> I hope Jeff's okay. <clears throat> yeah. Katina has a really legitimate question. Does Sasquatch have bugs? It is possible. Um, yeah, they're called Lake Fairies. <laughs> 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 like took off her boxer turban. Yeah. Oh boy. Yeah. Yeah. Ballerina. Look up ballerina ballerina illusion, please. From CJ. Look up the ballerina illusion. Okay, I'll see if I can find that. I'm not sure I know what that is. That should be interesting. Let's see. Um, I don't know what. Uh, I see a bunch of them. Yeah, so you can show it from my phone. Thank you, Grace. I didn't think to send it to my phone. Let me send this to your email. How about that? Oops. Cancel. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Does anybody know what that, that little tune is from? Mario. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I, was, I know. I was, I, was, I was just playing Mario last night. <laughs> do, 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 do. It's the fireboard. 
you, you see that thing on TikTok where it shows it, that you can have like 200,000 games from the 90s or it's 20,000. Um, I found one for $15. Works good. Nice. Except okay. for there are some really old games from the 90s that come from Japan and trying to figure out what they mean. <laughs> Because I don't read, I don't read uh, Japan language. What are we supposed to be looking at with the ballerina? The ballerina illusion. I I found like a, a whole bunch of pictures on that. I don't I don't know what I'm supposed to be sharing though. Is it the one with the the glass in the middle with the two ballerinas on the outside? Thanks. It could be. I've seen one similar yeah, to that. That's, that's a popular one. Yeah, it looks like the ballerina's spinning, but she's actually not. Yeah, and everyone has. Yeah, you, you can tell it's working because you can see Bigfoot's head swaying back and forth. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's too big. Oh, it's okay, though, right? That it's too big. Yeah, I can scroll down. Yeah. All right. Uh, let me get rid of that. That doodle house is interesting looking. What? I yeah, apologize. My life. I'm like struggling right now. We're not going to show this, but Nicole PNW sent that. I would never stand there. No, me either. Well, what is it? Um, well, wanna... we're going to show you. Hopefully. Mm, I don't know. Hopefully, this is a picture. You can do a solo too. I'm going to scroll down. Okay, this is this is the people standing there. It's just like a bunch of mirrors. It's yeah, it's a mi the mirrors. How is that possible? It's like clear glass. It's a room full of mirrors. Who? So there's I can see the people and, and there's more. mirrors on one side. It's like and there's a guy even laying down. In in a uh John a Wick or whatever it's called, John Wick. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Number three or something where they had like he was all in mirrors. Kind of like yeah. uh Game of Death or whatever with uh Bruce Lee as one of those. Well, what about oh all oh, the top is the reflection the dragon, I mean. upside down. Yeah, that's like the ceiling. Oh wait, but then I can't follow this picture. <laughs> D and W, yeah, I can't. Well, that is that the ceiling. That's is that the reflection of what's below? Well, yeah, but then on top they're standing upright. Yeah, right here standing yeah, up it's, there. Yeah, it's still the reflection though. Uh, um, uh, yeah, if you seen if you if you there's quite a few movies of this place. Oh, it's the another one. Was John Wick in this one? Yeah, there's th this was in uh, one of the John Wicks, too. Grace says it's the mirrored glass building in the city. I can't do that very well. Oh, no. I, don't, I have a hard time enough around the crowd of people now that I'm seeing 24 of them. <laughs> yeah, yeah CJ, the reflection of a reflection. If you can focus on one person and try to find that person again, You'll see them in multiple locations. Ah, okay. oh. that's messed up. Yeah, that is pretty weird. Imagine trying to run through that, <laughs> <laughs> running no. into people. Yeah, but are are you running into the real person or the the reflection of the reflection of the real person? Yeah, You'll find out once you hit when, oh. once you hit the mirror. <laughs> <laughs> it breaks the glass. You fall ten stories down. <laughs> CJ says no hiding in that in that space. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> you think you might be up against the wall, picking your wedgie or something, so no one can see. But somebody below you or up up above you, <laughs> 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 like fifty. Someone's got to see. <laughs> <laughs> Susie says the Matrix kind of stuff. I was looking for the one dressed in a red jacket. Yeah, <laughs> right. <laughs> oh yeah, the Matrix. Yeah. 
Thanks for sending that uh, P and W. Appreciate yeah, that. Yeah, that, that's really really cool. Yeah, we we uh, I, I don't know how we got on the subject of uh, optical illusions tonight. Just thought <laughs> thought it would be uh, something interesting to take up a couple minutes, and we took up a whole hour. <laughs> <laughs> that was a good idea. That was fun. I mean, you know. I want to show you guys. I know a lot of you guys weren't here at the very beginning. I'm going to show you guys the the intro that. That Lake made for this. It, that you made me make. Yeah. So for tonight. And yeah. Half, I'm going to play this. It's only 28 seconds. I only had like a half an hour. So here it is. Jeez. I like it. I think it's neat. Yeah, pretty cool. I like to play with oh, yeah. Snapchat and drive him crazy. <laughs> Actually, he you don't even have Snapchat anymore, do you? No. <laughs> <laughs> I don't have much of anything. Because <laughs> I drove me nuts. I, I just can't. I You know what? My social media consists of my YouTube channel. Pretty much it. No, he, okay, I'll tell you what happens. He goes to work and he hears ding or honk or he can't with it. He can't, not while he's working. So like all of us would be driving him nuts or talking with <laughs> each other. Like my my girls and like friends of and friends and family in Ohio and and he was working. So like things were just his phone was just making all kinds of noise. I can't. Yeah. He doesn't know how to turn things off. I just delete the app. <laughs> he deleted the whole app. Yep. Yeah. It's like I can't do Facebook. I can't do nope. any of that stuff. None of it. Twitter or X. Nope. Whatever they're calling <laughs> that thing now. I don't know. Next year it'll be something else. Yeah. I, I don't have time. Yep. I hate yeah. to say it though. X is stuff that we can't put anywhere else. True. Yeah, it's true. Really? Mostly stuff I don't want to know about anyway. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry, I got I know uh, quite a few people that that stopped doing YouTube and went straight straight to a Twitter thing. Yeah, I know uh, Bubba B Bubba News. He does uh, Telegram. Yeah. And uh, Peanut does rumble. Oh, that reminds me. I just put up a uh, put up a video on my rumble. See, it's pretty fun. So if you guys get a chance to check it out, yeah. It's I a, didn't get um, no notification. Yeah, weird. I don't know. It's on yeah. rumble right. I put it on this morning. I started putting on YouTube. You wouldn't let me, so I put it on rumble. I haven't <laughs> really been. On, I haven't been on my phone to see any notifications much today. Oh, it's okay. It's not like you guys have to, but if if, if you wanted to, you know, like it's, I'm not trying to get anybody to watch it. But and your uh, Rumble channel is called Creamy Nut Butter, right? Yeah. Capital C, capital N, capital B. I was like, the first time I got the notification, I forgot that you you made it. I'm like, what the heck is this? <laughs> is Creamy Nut I Butter. I didn't know this. <laughs> <laughs> this can't be a good thing. <laughs> hey, what did you ever figure out um, what what today is like in history? Oh, well, I don't really know if it's a, I guess, a positive or a good thing. Uh, but it's, I figured it was pretty interesting. Today is Atheist Day. Atheist oh. Day. I don't believe in that day. <laughs> I figured that was that they even had a day for that. That was something else. If you're uh, if you like chips and dip, today's chip and dip day. I'm on board. Let's do it. I'm always on board with that one. I didn't have any, but uh, thought oh. about it. Look, Peanut, kind of is, is it? Uh, this is my jam. Yeah, this is my jam. Yeah, that's it. Yeah. I never got a notification for it at all. 
<laughs> Postal truck, Al Bundy. <laughs> <laughs> what the Woody's truck? The nut, the nut house truck. Yeah. Yeah. Special, deliver, special delivery from nut house in his postal truck. <laughs> oh yeah, because I want a postal truck. Like is right, um, but like you is it postal or is it postal? Like going postal. Oh yeah, definitely not yeah. going postal. Like, raw. <laughs> <laughs> like, that's the last straw. <laughs> On this, day, with peanuts and people. <laughs> <laughs> on this day, March 23rd, 1775, pa Patriot Patrick Henry says, Give me liberty or give me death. Very good. That's quite quotable. Um, if you guys are on Rumble right there, Miss Grace just dropped uh, Mr. Peanuts' link for over there. Be sure All to right. uh, Thanks, Grace. find him <laughs> over there. Uh, and as Grace says, sub up. Thank you, Grace. Today in 1839 was the first recorded use of the word okay. Okay. And wait, what year was it? Uh, 1839. What was the context? What was the conversation? It was... Uh, it was printed in the Boston Boston's Morning Post, and it stood for all correct. Oh. Okay. Well, correct spell with a C. Doggone those newspapers. They can't think of anything right. But uh, yeah. this one, yeah, this one was uh, O. I think we lost one. This was in Boston, so maybe it was, uh, that's how you're supposed to pronounce it. I don't know. Yeah, you know the, the accent. The With the accent. Get the core. Wow. Get chowder. <laughs> it's wicked good chowder. <laughs> the water. BMW, that would be fantastic. <laughs> Someone like from from Bastion, they go to Texas and they're like, this is the worst chowder ever. It's chili. Not chowder. <laughs> <laughs> Not chowder, it's chilly. <laughs> um, says PNW says, I'll be going to Central California again soon. Would you like to try and grow a giant sequoia? Oh, me, yes. Yeah, heck yes. <laughs> Grace says, I didn't know that peanuts could dance. <laughs> oh, you see, watching it right on. Thanks, Grace. <laughs> I, this morning, I found that like that music. And I was like, "Whoa! Why didn't you know this existed?" And so I just made a quick video out of it. <coughs> you know, what's um, trivia. Peanut, you've put out a lot of um, uh very substantial content lately on your YouTube channel. It's it's not like rapid fire, but it's stuff that you've put a lot of time into. That's really good stuff. Oh, thanks. Thank you. Appreciate that. Chowder. Forget about it. <laughs> Forget about it. It's chowder. <laughs> <laughs> I got your chowder right here. It's funny. <laughs> so what else you want to do? We just kind of long with Hey, Miss Grace, could you do me a favor? Um, a friend of mine has a channel. It's called Dig Deeper Ministry. And he's, he's, a really good, he's a really good friend of mine. And he needs, he needs 13 subscribers to hit 1,000. I know. It's been You rough. haven't hit 1,000 yet? No. no. I, so I like, hit a roadblock. He'll get like right there to like 12 or 11 left to go, and then it'll fall back down. Yeah. What the heck? I get that sometimes too. It's weird, huh? Like you like they'll go up and then then a couple people fall off the bus. You're like, what? We we're so close. <laughs> we had this down. <laughs> <What's going> on? <laughs> Come on now. We've been over this, people. <laughs> You're supposed to stay on the bus. <laughs> yeah, magic, school, magic school bus. Uh, right, exactly. I want to go on the magic school bus. You guys better watch out. <laughs> you guys. Oh, I think he was a wise guy, huh? <laughs> He's a made fellow. 
Look at me, fella. <laughs> Come on, you Goombas. Subscribe already. Do you guys ever watch The Three Stooges? I loved them. Yeah. 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 No. No. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> no, I love The Three Stooges. They're hilarious. Those They're are classics. Fun. Or The Little Rascals. Oh, oh, yeah. Those are yeah. Right, I want to get up and walk around. I'm going to turn this show over to you. All right. Yeah, we're going to have to end here soon because I'm really having a hard time sitting, too. It's good seeing everybody. Hey, thanks for the compliment, Sue. Uh, when, he's out, when he's out, he's no out. <laughs> I just, it's hard time for me to sit for long periods of time because the sciatica, like the compression of my my back. <laughs> It just feels like it's compacting. And yeah. now I'm not going to go use that inversion table because I tried using that thing and that thing's like a torture device for me. I remember you I'm talking not, about that. Yeah, because I never know, like, that's what it's called, right? It's an inversion table. Yeah, the torture device. I love it. I know you love it, but what, see, what, things you, happen with my nerves. They get pinched okay. and moved and... Mm -mm. Ouch. That's so brutal, painful too. Back pain, I got that a little bit, not as bad as you do though. Uh, that does that stuff's terrible. Yeah, I, you never know when it's gonna gonna happen either. It doesn't count. It doesn't come with a warning or anything. I've been praying for you about that, and like like uh, for that that and for everybody we talked to that day, mm -hmm. uh, including someone that that bushcraft brought up. But I, I didn't want to bring it up because I don't know if they know or not. Appreciate it. Thank you. Oh yeah, thank you. Yeah. Thank you for thanking me for thanking you. Uh, thank you. Me. Oh. <laughs> he says you loved loved acupuncture. Oh, that's another big nope for me. I never had it. It doesn't sound good. Yes, I watched it. Hit the like button. What are we talking about? Any bets on how long till we hear snoring? <laughs> <laughs> I said that. Miss Sassy Cat. <laughs> yeah, it's kind of, I call it vapor lock. <laughs> it's a medical condition, but you wouldn't care. You wouldn't know. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, why do you always pick on me about my medical condition? And I'm like, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Can I tell him the story about how that came about? Like what I th I threatened him. What? On here. Okay, so so many many moons ago, I actually like after about I don't know what was it about a year a little over a year about a year not even maybe, and I told him if you don't go get that sleep study, something's like about to happen because I can't sleep. Like I was getting vile. I was in a really bad mood. I couldn't get a good night's sleep. Of course he wasn't either. And he was constantly getting headaches. And I said, you got to go do something. And he's like, yeah, yeah, I will. I will. I'm like, did you make that appointment yet? And he's like, no, I go, listen, if you don't make the appointment to do the sleep study, when you go to sleep tonight, I'm going to put a pillow over your head and make it stop. <laughs> yeah. So no. he's like, I would stop breathing. And I'm like, yeah, it's kind of like what you're doing now with all the snoring. So he went to the sleep study and I don't remember exactly all the stuff like we used to know, but he stopped breathing during his sleep so many times for like so many like seconds, a long period of time he would stop breathing. So yeah, long story mm -hmm. short, it's either the CPAP or he gets the pillow. My son just, just uh, did one of those. Studies. He's got narcolepsy, I think it's called. Oh yeah, that's where they fall asleep anywhere. Yeah, he fell yeah. asleep. He's fell asleep twice driving to work. Wow. Yeah, exactly. Driving one of one of his cars. That's not good. No, so I don't know what he's going to do with it. it. I think there's a medicine for that. Know uh, somebody like that? Well, I yeah. told him there. There's you know, there's little things that you can. Your head starts bobbing, it'll give you a shock and wake you up real quick. Oh, goodness. <laughs> yeah. 
So yeah. Yeah, I tried to. I tried to go. They had the home thing where you take the the machine home and you strap it on you and everything. Go when you go to sleep. Oh. Um, well, if it you doesn't, have... it doesn't work for me because you have to sleep for four hours. Yeah, yeah, you do. So the thing is, though, is that when when you when you do have the sleep apnea, then you have to go back and they do the machine for you. So then each yeah. machine is like what would work for you may not work for him, you know? Mm -hmm. Yep. So there's different pressures and, um, and they, there's like, and they said that that's when they took, they took my, um, they didn't even do the home thing for him. They went in and gave him a drug and everything and put him and put him to sleep and ran the machine. Yeah. Yeah. And they, they said, did. that's what they're going to do to me. And I said, what am I going to, I can't sit there and go someplace and sleep for eight hours. That's, I got things to do. Yes, Katina, sleep apnea is actually real. <laughs> yeah, and if it starts, it either puts the mask on or it gets the pillow <laughs> or the hose. Hello. Shh, shh, almost done. <laughs> <laughs> Don't struggle. <laughs> Uh, so yeah, DJ. So, so actually you don't need to do a full mask. You can do just the nose or you can just do the things like where people have oxygen, where they have like these yeah. little tubes that go up your nose. So you don't have to have a mask on because Bigfoot can't do that either. You don't have to yeah, have. I don't think I can handle a mask either. No, no. And they have the tube thing where like you can move anywhere I'm you want. I'm a wild sleeper goes with you oh i'm a wild sleeper too oh you should how see. i end up with all the covers the sheet the pillows everything he, he wakes up yeah. with nothing. <laughs> you should see the the test where they take you home that you have to wear to for and if, and if you move a certain way and then it starts beeping telling you oh you got to hook this up and i'm like who's supposed to go to sleep with this thing on because it wakes you up every 10 minutes Oh no! Yeah, exactly. Chip clip on the nose. <laughs> <laughs> no, Bigfoot's machine is silent, and unless something's wrong with the nose piece, and it goes, Psh, and trust me, I will wake him up to let him know. Like if I can't fix it while he's sleeping, in like two seconds, I will wake him up to let him know it's making noise. Like I, I need sleep. Yeah, and that right. Bigfoot's trying to get to 8,500. 8,500 and what? On Clash Royale. Oh, right. Yeah. I, got, I, I got up to 8,522. And he's, because once, okay, so like every 500 points or trophies, you stick there. Like you can't fall below anymore. And it's been like brutal trying to get there. And I don't remember what time a.m. it was, <laughs> but I did it. Nice. Yeah, yeah. Uh, waffles sound good. We should do waffles tomorrow. We have this waffle maker that like turns. It's got like the pedestal thing, and mm. like you just kind of waffles. Yeah. They're good. I bust out the waffle maker. <laughs> Great. I've had waffles in days. Um, <laughs> yeah, it's been a long time. Fat prep, prep. It could be uh, the Bitcoin. It's a a thing that happens every four years. Silver Um, I think it's in April twenty second. It's uh, and it's very hard to explain, but basically, uh, it's getting cut in half. Um. The stuff that the miners mine up to, to make a, a blockchain, mm -hmm. it's getting cut in half. And it, it does this every four years. That's why there's no inflation it, for, for Bitcoin. There's It's like zero, I think it's like 1% inflation right now. And eventually it'll, it'll get down to zero. 20, I don't know, in like eight eight years or so. It might be more than that, 12 years. Where did but the weird thing is, normally, 
when this ha half thing happens, uh, Bitcoin jumps way up, and then and then it'll it'll go down a little bit. But this year it went it's went way up before the the halfy thing came came about. So everybody's freaking out; they don't know what's going on. That's fair. Weird. Thank you, Karen. So an oxygen tank, Katina. I think you're kidding. As a tank full of oxygen <laughs> to help people breathe so they can carry it on, like people who have COPD and whatnot. And sometimes you only need it for a little while, not long term, like for pneumonia or whatever. And yeah, yeah, that the nasal pillow, that's what it's called. Yep. Cat, cats are, as a, a guy, did you know that? Like, no, but I do now. Yeah, yeah. because it, I I did the same thing. That's why because like I used to call him Cat Tina, but um, but it's, it's it's he's a funny guy. But it's like it's cat in a birdcage. But I think yeah, it's, yeah. A cat in a birdcage instead of Cat Tina. Yeah, I I did the same thing. Cat in a birdcage. He's funny though, huh? I'm sure it's a joke. But the I'm uh, half serious. He's hilarious. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I love cats. And sometimes I'm half mad. <laughs> <laughs> He's so cool. Yeah. Thanks. Okay. Half so, serious. That's the fun. Yeah. Yeah. So you're a dude. <laughs> okay. That's so cool. I wasn't sure. I mean, I, no offense to Chris uh, Piat, but I wasn't really? sure for a long time if she was a girl or a guy. I didn't know. You know. Yeah. So, so I met her, and then like, oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, Chris and Pat and all those names can Aaron, a a Ron, they all can be like <laughs> <laughs> both sexes. Yeah, yeah. There's believe it or not, they're supposed to come out at seven twenty one every morning, but sometimes YouTube freaks out and it it doesn't come out at all, and I have to go back and check them. Like this morning. It was like after 10 o'clock, and I was like, it's not out yet? Is that for your shorts that you do? Yeah, the Daily Blessing. No, yeah. Man. I like those. Me too. They're well written. Of course, sometimes I have to catch up on four or two, but <laughs> I'll try. <laughs> um, yeah, if anyone doesn't know that Bushcraft does, Bushcraft family does. Uh, these daily prayers they're in the shorts some people don't know that about channels so when you go to someone's channel it'll have like videos shorts um lives, what, lives um community oh, yes. posts yeah. oh, community posts too if you push on those things individually it'll take you to the channel creator's short <clears throat> or it'll take you to like all their lives on this playlist, yeah. And you got notified for the 18th one? <laughs> <laughs> I don't get it. I don't get it. Yeah, yeah. some of them uh, I'll get like maybe five or ten views on. And, mm -hmm. th and then in a week, there's a thousand views on it. I'm like, what happened there? I know. Mm -hmm. Yeah. yeah. I, yeah. It's, it's a short. I think that's the, the thing. That's what happened with mine and Allie's short, the bacon one. It's like, mm -hmm. how does this thing almost have 2,000 views already? Like, how? We're and just that, messing around. I, and, if I, and if I make a video on it, YouTube won't put it out. But if I do it in the short, they actually put it out. Yeah, they're trying to pump the shorts out for sure. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah, Bigfoot tried to make me make more shorts on the channel. <laughs> I think we've all been getting kind of short change on views and all that sort of thing. And like and like pumping out um like putting us in the, the turn of faucet on to get us because like I don't know. I know you get you get a lot of views bushcraft, but it seems like you should get a lot more. No, though. I don't. You don't oh that's lame, no. dude, I don't get so that's why I think they're they're messing with you. Like I, I think they have in the lake for a while, right? If not now, I don't know. I don't follow everybody like numbers, but um but just in general, the people I know, it seems like, or, or Bigfoot, he was talking about, man, he's barely getting like, you know, yeah. trying. So I'll put out a short tomorrow. 
What day did I think it's what, what day did I say it was, T? I don't remember saying what today was. The twenty third. I think he's just trying to confuse me. Twenty third of March. What? Man, this time next week it'll be Easter Eve. Yeah. Yep. I so want the April Fool's Easter instead, though. <laughs> right. I don't awesome. think it ever has. Has it? Has there ever been April well, Fool's Easter it right now? That would be amazing. We'll have to look that up. I remember one year, yeah. um, I was living in Oregon for a while, and like uh, a one one time on East, I was out for driving on Easter Sunday. There was a well, rabbit that they yeah. actually it has. Oh, really? Easter Sunday fell on April 1st in 1921, 1934, 1945, and 1956. Oh, so it's been a while. Yeah, we're due. Yeah, we're due. Since it hasn't happened since like the 1950s, but a few times Easter has fallen on April 1st. weird. Huh. It's like that's the day we get raptured. <laughs> right <laughs> on April Fool's Day, oh, <laughs> and was like, "No, this is a joke." Please, I mean, <laughs> Paul does have a sense of humor. So. <laughs> that would be amazing, All right? <laughs> All right. Um, I remember one year it was Easter, and um, there was a like a dead rabbit in the road. Someone hit a rabbit or something. Yeah. I wanted to like leave little, yeah, I wanted to leave little Easter eggs by oh, the man. <laughs> 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 uh, <laughs> Like he was making his rounds, like, damn it, they killed the Easter bunny. You <laughs> so one on one's not going live tonight, but I think he's going live tomorrow night, right? Yeah, tomorrow. Yeah. Tomorrow. Morning joyful noise and notes will be live at 10 30 a.m. Eastern time, followed by Dick Deeper Ministry at 11 05 um, tomorrow morning. And then what else is happening tomorrow? Is that when they do six o'clock or seven? Yeah, Vineyard Chicks will do yeah. six o'clock. Okay. Tomorrow evening. Okay, so the vineyard chicks do six o'clock tomorrow night, and that's what Easter survival, Standard Time Survival Seeds 2024, right? They always have like a guest on, right? Yeah, yeah. I forget the lady, I forget her name, the guest for tomorrow. <laughs> I thought it was actually tonight, but I missed it. I think she's from not too far from where I live, if I'm not mistaken. Possibly. And then Monday night. Well, I think one of one's going live tomorrow night too. I don't know. And then Yeah, he said he was going. Well, yeah. he said he was going. He says he will. We'll see. Yeah. Yeah. He's, and then he, Monday night, seven PM, Bush Coffee yeah. goes live, followed by the Vineyard Chicks Homestead. Monday nights are fun because you get Bushcraft, and then you go over to the Vineyard Chicks Homestead, and they have a playlist. After they're done, they take requests, so you can just ch yeah. chillax, dance in your living room, your kitchen, grab your kid or your spouse or someone off the street, <laughs> dance. I might do that. <laughs> it's a lot. See how it goes. Just, yeah, take your phone just anywhere. Like, just walk around and be like, hey, <laughs> I would do What I want to know, Peanut, who, who's the girl in the, with the, the GIF peanut butter on her head? Oh, I don't know. <laughs> I have no idea who, idea who that is. Thanks for watching, though. But, um, <laughs> it was some random GIF that I picked up, so I put it in there. A GIFy GIF? Yeah. A GIF GIF. <laughs> I think that's the joke is like because some people pronounce it GIF, some people yeah. pronounce it GIF. So, but it kind of worked out well. This is your Rumble video. Yeah. Yeah. Are we are we still live right now? Yeah. If you want to share it out, you can. Like uh, the link. Oh. 
Um, I don't know how to do that, like from here to there and here. From here to there and there to here. Yeah. <laughs> Funny things are everywhere. I know exactly what I was thinking, right? Dr. Seuss, yeah. <laughs> Hello, hello. I can't hear you. Hello. I know not why. My mouth has cut the wire. Goodbye. Oh, yeah. Or was there a burr in his ear? Oh, 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 the burr I like to hold. That was hilarious. Oh, yeah. I have a bird I like to hold. Yeah, my teeth are... Gold or something? What you... Yeah, my teeth are... Or my hat is... Oh, I think we tried to do this before, and I used to know this so well. I don't remember. So what were we doing? been a long day oh i was gonna your, um, put my link your, in rumble, your, your rumble thing i can put it in there i was already oh, okay thank actually you right there now you're the only reason i ever go there and i don't go there a lot so i don't know i tried to do it but it took forever to upload there you yeah I, I didn't know that's what you guys were wanting and i'm like oh i'm sitting i'm right on the page now <laughs> i'm so sorry thank right, you thank you yeah, so that link that Bushcraft. This is my jam. I, I yeah. was gonna, uh, I was gonna put it. Sorry, I, I cut you. Off. That's okay. I was just telling everybody that that's your Rumble channel. And you get to watch Peanut shake his his booty. Exactly. <laughs> you don't want to miss that. That's where the peanut butter comes from. <laughs> 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 That's more like the chocolate peanut butter, though. You know, with that canolta or whatever they added to it. People love that. Yeah. Nutella. Nutella, yeah. It's like Nutella. the Nutella. Right? <laughs> <laughs> you don't want the chunky one, though. Let me just tell it's you. Like right a that's, <laughs> Nutella is like a hazelnut spread, though. Yeah, yeah hazelnut. you don't want the canolta. Yeah, you don't want the canola kind. <laughs> <laughs> it's like a chocolatey nut spread. Right. It's a chocolatey nutty surprise in every bite. <laughs> I think I had a nuts on it one time. <laughs> it's like a nutty adventure, if you will. Well, well you but, notice when everybody uses uses the to prank people that they got poop on their hands or something. It's Nutella. Oh, <laughs> oh dude. Yeah. that's funny. Dude, that would be awful. The, the commercials oh. or the the little shorts where they can you get me some toilet paper? And the little kid comes in there and dabs some. Oh, I'm sorry. And they, they start freaking out. <laughs> oh. oh, man. That's horrible. <laughs> hey, friends, man. Uh, where did this month go? I don't know. I, I can't wait till it's over, to be honest with you. <laughs> March has just not been good. One more week. One more week. Yeah, you're right. One Pat more Lewis week. Says the moon is bright. Are you talking about peanuts, moon? Or <laughs> <laughs> it's definitely bright, bright yellow. Yeah, twenty fifth full moon. All right, so a couple days. So usually for like a couple days before and after, it, it can seem really bright and full. And and when peanut is dancing. You know, when he shakes, you can hear his nuts rattling inside. <laughs> right? Something for everyone to look forward to. Yeah, as long as long as they're roasted, because if they're raw, all those things are bad. Right. We're talking about raw peanuts. Oh. Moon is pretty bright tonight. I gotta I'm not gonna have the right icon thing when I do this, but that's okay. I've gotta go. Where's Lake going? I'm here. She got she's got a booger. Oh. No, I don't. I don't have a booger. I was just trying <laughs> to unhook. Had a booger. I'm trying to unhook some of the stuff, and I didn't want to freeze because if I unhook stuff, the screen freezes, and I always have a stupid looking face when I freeze. <laughs> you know, I check it do. <laughs> <laughs> It's like before I learned how to do the, um, uh, what are they called? Before I learned how to do the YouTube thumbnails, YouTube would always have oh. me 
talk on the dumbest looking face ever. Yeah, they still do that. They do. I'm sure they do. Uh, they do it on purpose. It's like, or like. <laughs> I make video. Holly just walked through the door and she's like, <laughs> she's probably used to it by now. Mm, she still kind of gives us that look. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for sharing that. Yes, we need to push this. He's almost to a thousand. He's over. There. Yeah, I, I thought he was our, would be an, already over the thousand mark. Yeah. No, not yet. He's patiently waiting. Can you see how patiently waiting he is? <laughs> I try to push it out there, but it, it's patience, patience, grasshopper. Ali has this T-shirt on that I like love. We were talking like the person that's or the thing that's on her shirt earlier. You want to come over and show everyone your shirt? She's having one of those t-shirt sweatpants days and she's rocking it. This t-shirt is so fun. Oh, cool. <laughs> oh, cool. Aid. Cool. Aid. <laughs> cool aid. Oh, yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> oh, wait, man. We can yeah. actually get her voice pretty deep. And they they got rid of him because wokeness again. I don't understand. Oh boy. Why I would you? love to hear this one. <laughs> oh it, again, it it was racist. I have no oh, idea why okay. racist. A picture of Kool-Aid can be racist, but yeah. The racism. I don't know how. I mean, everybody uh, had Kool Aid except for me. I wasn't allowed to have Kool Aid only on special occasions because they had too much sugar. Well, it's the sugar's not the bad stuff. It's the the coloring. The coloring. Uh, yeah. yeah. We we're talking about that red forty. Oh yes, that's horrible. Oh, man, I used to put Kool Aid in Allie's hair because her hair is so light blonde, especially in the summer when she was little. I used to color the ends of her hair. What are you doing? You have a good chin on your face. Your face looks all disfigured. Mm -hmm. You think my face looks disfigured? You have your camera at a weird angle. I just had it where where Dad had some it. optical illusions yeah, that I mean, we were watching. Yep. Made the camera walk. It looks like you're bald there, but you're not. It's but I don't like, know. Well, somebody <laughs> said my hair looks bad in the camera. Yeah. It looks red. Well, looks like hair. You want to see my hair now? Your hair looks red too. That's weird. Your color is off on your laptop. Even Allie's hair looks red. It does look red. Both of you guys it look does. red. Her her hair is like blonde, 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 like super light blonde. That's weird. Yeah, both of our hair looks red. That's the Irish. Here's you. My goodness, I think it's almost time to end this thing unless you guys want to have more conversation. I want pizza rolls. You want pizza rolls? She wants pizza rolls. Uh, <clears throat> I'm about ready have anyway. You, I got stuff to do anyway. Have you ever tried a frozen pizza roll? I rather cut my foot off. <laughs> I actually uh, tried those one night on a drive back home. They were actually pretty good. Really? Gross. That's yeah. gross. The frozen. Yeah, but they're, <laughs> everything in it's cooked already. It's, it was, just was frozen. Yeah. Pizza no, I, don't think, it's, yeah. Uh, I don't think I could do it. Make add blue to the camera filter. I don't know how to do that. I got it. I got a bail. Thanks for having me up. All right. Thank you All for right. coming. Oh, you hey, peanut. Hey, Ellie. Later. What? Later. With you. You, <laughs> All right. Let's see. Um, settings, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> let's see. Camera. Touch up. This Bigfoot's. Laptop is working super, super slow, too. 
Yeah, I noticed that whenever you guys are open the pages. Yeah, it's bad tonight. Like really bad. I don't think it has anything for blue or I don't know. It doesn't do anything. Hmm. I can see Orion's belt directly above me. Yeah. I have one on my arm. So do my kids. That's really weird. Huh? The Orion's belt on our arm where we have the three. Yeah. yeah. You got the dipper. Too. Our dogwood blooms got frozen. Oh, no. Did you get snow, too? Hmm. I don't you know if it's the I didn't go outside, but it was snowing earlier. PNW is flirt. Are you getting snow, snow still? I am. I don't know. I just noticed it when I was in the kitchen, looked out the window. See, there's other people. They're like, you ate them frozen. <laughs> yeah, Warm it's. Up. He was driving. My hair isn't red. Yeah, we don't have red hair. It's we do today. It's an illusion, exactly. I don't know the Auburn. Yeah, we're, we don't have red hair. It's really weird. I don't know what's going on with the camera. I mean, this sweatshirt isn't even that blue. It's like a purpley color. <laughs> no, this is actually like a purpley color. It's not no, even it's blue. Not colorblind person. It's like a. <laughs> Like a dark blue. No, it's purpley blue. It's not purple at all. Purpley blue. You want to argue about it? Yeah, you're wrong. It is weird, though, because mine and Allie's hair isn't even the same. That's creeping me out. All right. Well, I guess unless you guys have something else to talk about, we're going to go end here and go relax. It's been a crazy busy day with the snow. Yeah, I didn't do much today, but it felt like a long day. Yeah, it's been a, I slept in. I didn't sleep in. I got up pretty early. Mm. We got to get up early, too, because we got to go into the out, and then Bigfoot's got his uh, dream at 11. Uh, <laughs> oh, no, God, the noise was that. Was that like a fit? <laughs> <laughs> All right, we all have a great night. <laughs> Was that an elephant? Yeah. Ready? Possibly. <laughs> I hope that I hope you guys could hear that. Like that sweater matches the blue in the picture behind you. Yeah, it kind of does. Yeah, yeah, that's mm -hmm. one of one that I did. That's like. Josh's favorite picture that I've done. I don't know why. He likes it. And it has a dragon in it, too. <laughs> Does it? <laughs> Ew. That, that was sound so, so creepy. That was gross. Alexa is unplugged. And she said, she, did you guys hear that? She was whispering. <laughs> That's no, not right. No, it was whispering. She's like, it's not reachable. I didn't get that. The internet is Oh, reachable. man, that was kind of creepy. Why does it sound different now? I don't know why she whispered. That was complete. That that made my heart, like, drop into my stomach and back up again. Mm -mm. I'm done with it. You heard her whisper, right? It sounded menacing. Mm. She had to like that <clears throat> her voice too. No, I looked behind me. It was plugged in. Sorry, a coin. Yeah, I said it was mm. unplugged, but it's like off the internet. Like it doesn't, it shouldn't be talking at all. She's was like a menacing whisper. Yeah. Telling I I have mind where it's the ports are blocked, but she'll still talk and everything. Yeah, I don't like that. Um, there's there's a certain port. I think it's sixteen, sixteen hundred and something. Uh, oh. That you that that way, whatever you say doesn't get sent back to who wherever it goes. 
That's creepy. So it, it'll receive stuff, but it, it can't send it back out. Oh my goodness. Yeah. So anyway, I'll be sitting yeah. here and that thing will say, Oh, you want to play this song. And, and you like, didn't even ask, right? Like, yeah. remember that one night we were in our room, just Allie and I were in mine and Bigfoot's room, and he was sleeping out in the living room. He just started talking about and his the big D squatch napper, and I was speaking about what? Oh, like I was talking about like a demon or something. No, no. Are you allowed to say that? No? I don't know if you don't. Oh yeah, I wouldn't talk about that. Um, well, that's what she was it about. wasn't demons; it was something else. Like uh, when you're not here anymore, I was talking something about that, and all of a sudden, you know who just started going off and something, and <laughs> I don't even know. It was really creepy, but, and yeah. And another time, she was going off. She started playing this weird song. It was so creepy. She talks yeah. when she's not supposed to. Yeah. It's the weirdest songs that you would never even ask for. No. I why I'm feeling English. <laughs> You're not, I'm not feeling English, but not anymore. <laughs> not anymore. <laughs> what was it the score that yeah. What was it? What was it called? Tech tech no no. <clears throat> it was English and the part of that chorus part, what was it called? I don't know. There was a part of a test last year that Ellie took for homeschool, and I had it was a part of English. So, like, she had English, and there was just one small part of English. She there was reading and there's... English lit. No, it's I don't remember, but basically, it's like a grammar thing, it is. And it... <laughs> She doesn't have very good role models. <laughs> no. No, I do not. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Okay, everybody go to bed so I can have my pizza roll. All right. I will uh, talk to you guys soon. Um, that's all I have to say. God bless and hope I'll see you guys over <laughs> At Joy for Noise and Notes tomorrow morning at 10.30 Eastern and dig deeper at 11.05. And if not, then we'll see you Monday over at Bushcraft Families at 7 o'clock, followed by the Vineyard Chicks Homestead at 9 o'clock. Where we will not talk about food. Are we will You know no. what's going to happen. It's definitely going to happen. Definitely no, going to talk about food again. Yeah, even Allie is like, are they talking about food again? <laughs> God bless everyone in Jesus' name. Have a great night. Good night, Joe.